Anna Simone with Ciccone Simone. David Pontrini, I'm a partner at the firm Hariri Pontrini Architects. And I'm one of the principals of Ciccone Simone. And this is a joint venture for the VIEW project between our firm and Young and Wright Architects. What's been really interesting with VIEW is we have not been focusing on anything that's gimmicky. Uh, which is really refreshing. We've got an amazing client that gave us the opportunity to develop an entire block in the downtown core. View is exactly what it is being promoted as being. In a block that's got such strategic connections to the neighborhood. It is, uh, it's an area that has a tremendous amount of creative talent. It has an ability to capture some amazing views of the downtown skyline looking towards the west. Starting from artists to producers to writers. And it became very clear to us that this was a unique site. The view project had a uh, a strategic location overlooking St. James Park and we use that as a major jumping off point for the scheme. And I really believe that VIEW is one of the few projects that's capturing the true essence of what a loft is. We're really trying to develop a scheme that fits into the neighborhood and is respectful of the context that it's existing in, that ties in in terms of the material palette, that marks the view terminus of Adelaide and that really takes advantage of the, the views overlooking the park. But most of all, we want a building that is characteristic of the area and becomes a good neighbor. Instead of taking away from the area and not enhancing its history and its, its, its place in history, we've done quite the opposite. And we originally thought of it as a, a series of buildings that relate to the existing context, the historical context within the area, but also had a series of taller elements that took advantage of the great views of the Toronto skyline, the city skyline, and also overlooking St. James Park and the cathedral. How this project differentiates itself is not through its bells and whistles or its feature, it's to be very much grounded within the area and not look like something that has totally disregarded what the area is about. View is unique from many different perspectives and if we were to look at some of them we can start off by saying that its architecture is certainly very characteristic of the area. Right from the beginning is we work a lot in 3D models, physical models. We have a shop downstairs where we construct different uh, scenarios for the project and as we develop the ideas more carefully and clearly we, we actually start to create more finely grained models like the, uh, the models that are uh, distributed across the table. I feel that what uh, Harari Pontarini have done uh, has, has been excellent and it's reminiscent of the whole character of the area. What we tend to, to do on all of our schemes is to work very closely with the interior designers and we're always advocating that they be brought in very early on into the design process. And what we're doing here at VIEW, the architect and the interior designer, have worked quite closely together to ensure that there is that seamless approach in terms of where one discipline begins and the other ends. So we think it's a critical component of the overall project to include the interior designers as part of the consultant team that starts right at the beginning of the project, as soon as possible. VIEW is great for many reasons. It's, um, it's great for its location. It's great for its architecture, it's great for its design. The team that has been put together for VIEW is a team that is very experienced within the high rise um, within the high rise sector. I think that this project is quite different from many of the other projects that we've done in the sense that it is deeply rooted in its, in its neighborhood, in the old town, and really tries to take advantage of that connection to the old town and to its neighborhood. Many of the other projects that we've done in the downtown area don't have that same kind of connection to the context in terms of the historic nature or character and this one is unique from that point of view. The mandate of the project has always been to make it the best that it can possibly be and it has been very true to that. Nine times out of ten we find ourselves deleting most of the things that we've brought to the table. With VIEW it's been quite the opposite. We found ourselves adding more in order to give it that personality and character that's so deserving of its location.